Hi everyone, Pase Baller here. We are now on this quarterfinals of Eurobasket 2022. So we're down to eight teams left. Man, it was a crazy second round. Um, a lot of upsets, man. There were a lot of upsets. I gotta admit, there were a lot of um, wins that I did not expect to happen. Um, so again, uh, we're down to eight teams. Um, quarterfinals. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see what's gonna happen. So. Um, let's start off with this uh, matchup against Spain and Finland. That'll happen 11.15 p.m. Manila time. That'll be on a Tuesday. So that'll be 11.15 morning Eastern Standard Time. Again, that's on Tuesday, all right? Um, Spain, they, uh, they just defeated um, what, who was expected uh, to win that matchup, and that's uh, Lithuania. They defeated Lithuania by, I guess, eight points, I guess that was. Um, and man, it was just crazy. Um, I picked uh, Spain to win, uh, but with a plus. And that's why when Spain won, like, uh, Spain won, uh, outright. Spain made it here to the quarterfinals. I was really, you know, I was really happy. I was surprised. Now, for this other, uh, team, Finland, they went up against, uh, Croatia. Um... And man, that was crazy. Markinen, uh, their superstar, had 43 freaking points, man. 43 points. That was just crazy. Um, I'm not sure if they can actually uh, have a repeat of that kind of performance. But if Markinen can continue to lead the team, if Markinen can, can continue to rebound and to attract a defense for them, Finland would have a very good chance. The spread, by the way, is minus 6.5 for Mighty Spain. I mean, if you take a look at the uh, back, uh, at the box scores of uh, that ga that game, Spain versus uh, Lithuania, the one who led the the team was Lorenzo Brown with 28 points, and he was followed up by the Hernan Gomezes. Both of them had double digit points. Now, this one's going to be very hard for me. Um, I don't know with how Spain uh, performed and how uh, Spain got that game over Lithuania. I think Spain would actually win the game, like the game game, but in terms of the spread of 6.5, minus 6.5, I'm going to go with Finland on this because of how Finland performed, because of um, uh, because of the momentum that they also have. They're not backing down, man. Um, I'm pretty sure they're, Markkinen won't be able to score that much, that 43 points, but I'm pretty sure that Markkinen would still be able to provide um, enough for their teammate to cover that 6.5 spread. My pick on this one would be Finland plus 6.5. Again, that is Finland plus 6.5. Peace out, pase love, and God bless.